Today, we're gonna to talk about the fastest growing job in America. My name is Bobby Davis and I launch software companies and careers. People come to me when they want to make a switch in their career and study software development. They like being trained at my school because I've built software companies and I know the type of skills employers like me want. If you've been learning how to code but feel frustrated with your progress, go to codefounder.com slash syllabus. Download the information and my team will take care of you. So, hands down, the best career in America right now is coding. But not just any kind of coding. The fastest growing job title last year was full stack application developer. The demand for that job has skyrocketed. Years ago, the government made a prediction about the growth of coding jobs, but companies ended up hiring 65% more developer jobs than predicted. They didn't understand how hungry employers would be for technical talent. They should have asked me. I started three software companies and I've had a hard time filling positions in every one of them. It's crazy. I have to hire headhunters and pay them huge commissions to find a developer. The reason? Devs already have a great job. And I have to lure them away with a higher salary. And to keep them from quitting, I often have to give them yearly raises, free food, special desks, new equipment. I have to decorate the, the rooms like a comic book. And it's not just my software companies like mine. Non-software companies are hiring developers at an even faster rate. And that's why I say coding is the economic mobilizer of our time. Now, there are three benefits to having a coding career that no other job can match right now. Number one, salary freedom. The average salary of an application developer is about 80K. And that's 30,000 more than the average salary of an American worker. Now, depending on where you live, 80K is enough for your family to have just one working spouse. One of my favorite things I like to hear a coder founder graduate say is this, I just got a raise and now I can make enough to retire my spouse. That's really powerful. Now, I've seen Coder Founder students earn enough to take care of themselves and contribute to the people and the causes they feel passionate about. Salary is only one aspect that makes this career amazing. And number two is called location freedom. Now, think about this. If you work in finance, you're probably going to live in New York, Chicago, or Charlotte. If you're in energy, you're probably going to work in Texas. If you work in film, then you're going to be in L.A. Yes, there are exceptions, but they're small. Most professions have certain regions and cities that you are forced to live in. Coding's different. There's a company in a small town in South Carolina that makes lighting for factories. Recently, they started building the software that powers those lights. And now the software has become the main part of their business. This manufacturing company in a small city needs developers. As a matter of fact, they hired a Coder Foundry student. But multiply their story times every business in America. If you know how to code, you can move anywhere you want and get hired. Sometimes you can even work from home. No other career is like that. And number three is job freedom. It's not talked about, but the average job length for a developer is three years. And when you look at a developer's resume, you'll see that they've had like four jobs in the last 10 years. And any other career, that's a bad thing. But in software, it's almost a red flag to see one developer at one job too long. So imagine this, you're working at a job and the work is kind of crummy. You're not learning. You're not growing. You're on old tech. Your boss gives you unrealized deadlines. He yells at you. So you open up LinkedIn and list yourself as open for opportunities. Later that day, a recruiters contact you. Some want to talk to you immediately. Others want to take you to lunch to talk about your goals. Others want to submit you for a job right now and ask you when can you leave. What do you, what do you mean? What are you, what are you doing? Well, first, I'm changing my LinkedIn status to looking for work. Oh. Already? Recruiters move fast these days. This is Guilfoyle. Dazzle me. So as funny and as ridiculous as that scene from Silicon Valley is, it's not too far from the truth. You can literally, as a developer, call your recruiter and probably be interviewing the very next day. This is the life of a developer. You're never ever stuck in a current job. There's no better career in America than as a software developer. Even if you like your current job, I highly suggest that you become a designer who codes, a salesperson who codes, or an accountant who codes. If you want to learn how to do that, I created a school that can help you. Go to coderfounder.com slash syllabus and learn about what we teach, how we place you into a new job. In the meantime, good luck and keep coding.